So before we go in, I just want to give a quick disclosure. This room is not no dream nursery or nothing like this. It's just basically my workplace and how I work. Hopefully we get some light in here. I don't know. Let's see how the if it'll lighten up. Mm. Okay, so here is where my changing table is. I usually do a lot of videos over here in this corner. Um, up there, like I have some little pictures and then picture of Prototype India, which will, it was Prototype Kit, but she's India. Um, and I have Phoebe picture up. I have not been able to get my room in a uniform way because it has to function as so many different things. This is Ziggy, my boy Billy. He is a baby that I intend to be in my forever collection and I don't know. I'm gonna probably see if I can turn some lights on in here so that I can get better photos. Yeah, let me see if I don't see how this works. All right, so I brought, put my, I put some of the lights up and so let's let this focus in um this is not where my babies are and stuff this is just to have them all here in one video i just kind of put them everywhere oh, i forgot one more of the baby oh well um i so at least these are the babies that are out so that so we have bailey Bridget, Indy, Piper, and then over here we have Ziggy, which is my Billy. And we can, if we can get the camera to focus on Billy. Sometimes I tell you these lights don't don't be working in your favor. Let's see and see and see. Anyway, you guys see him. And then over here we have Vegas. I want to pull my lights over a bit more. So over here we have Vegas. The lights might be a little too bright on him. And then we have Joey. We have Aspen, which I'll come back over here so you guys can see we have Aspen and we have Taraji we have Taraji we have Ayani You know, Ayani is my, uh, uh, my little yawning baby. <laughs> All right. So we have Ayani. Um, we have Jelly Bean. You guys. And then we have Logan. And we have Brayden, Gigi, Nori. This baby is not named because she is not going to be my baby. Um, she was a private order, so, and she's not put together either. But, and then we have Phoebe. We need light. Can we get some light in here? Yeah, so we have Phoebe and we have Orion. So that's the babies that we have for now that's out. I do have several packed away. Um, so let me explain a little bit the function of this room and why I struggle with being able to really get it to where I enjoy the decor. First of all, that is not gonna stay, that basket is not gonna stay on my stool. I sit on that stool and paint sometime. Um, 
I just didn't want her on the floor. So I put her there. I'm actually ordering a Moses basket stand for her for this basket. Um, and I rotate my babies so they don't have no permanent spaces really, to be honest. Um, oh, and then of course you see pictures of my grandkids are up there. Um, over here is what I've been wanting to do for the longest. This is the divider. On the other side is my my new office. <laughs> well, all I do all my silicone painting. Um, so, and then we have this. And the new add-on is actually, I added a TV here. And um, into my, my room because when I'm painting, I listen to my iPad, um, or, you know, I can't really watch it completely, but I, I'll have a show on with my iPad. And sometimes my iPad go dead and I'd be so mad. So, all right, so I'm gonna show you what I've done so far in here, and then I'm gonna show you, and then you guys will see when I can get it all the way done. So this part down here is not completely done, but I don't mind. I have a sign. Uh, I have a sign here that I need to put up that says welcome to my crib. Um my light bulb blue and I need to order some more. Um I have diapers, I have some of my baby bottles. Um I had to take stuff down cuz I removed two shelves above the changing table to put the TV there. So I haven't organized this part, but I do have a scale. And I've only used it a few times, but I think I'm going to start pulling it out to use. I have pillows for when I do for posing. Um, so this changing table serves as a purpose to do videos, for changing videos a lot. Um, this crib, I have three cribs. So I have the matching one to this one, the white one. And I usually have two white ones in here. And I had this one down in my guest bedroom. But... I realized that my light is better. I get better lighting up here for photos and I decided to bring this one up. Because it can be like a day bed, it allows me to be able to, you know, get down low and not have the bars in the way blocking the crib. So like if I had want to take a picture of a baby laying down, you would see those bars. I don't have to worry about that here. So that's why I brought this up here so again now I bought this bedding to match my bedding down at my guest bedroom so now I have to change the bedding and try to coordinate everything I'm going to change out my curtains and stuff but this room have to serve so many purposes it's where I display my babies where I enjoy my babies but at the same time it's my work too so when I want to take pictures I um added this crib so I can do more photos, more natural photos of the babies in the crib. Um, I've had these pieces like the rockers and stuff like that so they don't really like necessarily go-go but the gray and yellow I will keep because the room has kind of got gray and the yellow so it's okay. This little rocker used to be um, Bryson's. He never really used it because he was scared of it. So my daughter gave it to me. So I thought it was cool for my bigger babies to sit in that. Um, and also when I do get my rug down and stuff, I'll be able to take like more pictures. Um, that chair is gonna go away, but I've had it for many years, that rocker. Um, so yeah, so this is just space for me to, you know, and then I store my boppy underneath so when I want to pull that out, I can pull it out. Down here, underneath this bed, because it has a higher thing, I have storage. I have some Reggie Ann body, bodies in there. And I have one kit that I didn't have no space for in there. And then I have, this is doubled over, but it's actually a case of different diapers. Because as you guys know, I collect diapers. So now I'm going to turn this camera over here. Um, I removed the shelf from over here that was wide and did a more narrow stand-up shelf. 
um, and it gave me four drawers, which gave me more space. So I have um, my towels because when I wash my silicone babies off after matting and stuff like that, I need towels. So I keep those there, the lint-free towels. I have, um, well, I have them in one of them, and then blankets, and then new, the newer clothes um, that I plan on putting the babies on soon. I'm keeping them out so I don't have to go into the closet. And so, um, I'm just showing you guys this how I make it work for me in my space. I, you know, I have too many dolls to be honest because I obviously don't keep them all in this room because I don't like the clutter. Um, so in this drawer, I have not organized. I mean, um, put the labels on it yet, but I bought these little label things. I don't know if you guys can see. Wait. So they like have pockets on it and I got, um, different cards. Like I can do these cards in there and put the label or I can do these. I plan on do using these though to put like what is in there and it'll just be a general thing. Like. Um, I know I did mostly all soft shoes and like uh, some dress shoes in here. These are boys, boy shoes, um, hair ties, like um, headbands and the barrettes. Then behind there is sandals. I don't know if you guys can see that. A box, there's a container of sandals. Then there's pacifiers, pacifiers, pacifiers. Um, and I, I haven't brought all these in here. I have packs of my socks, my tube socks that I like. The little long socks like. Um, and then I have my paints behind there. And I have my paint supplies in here. Because I packed up this table. Um, so I'm going to label all this. I just wanted to make sure that everything was going to stay in the container in which I have it in already. This is a baby scent air freshener. Um, I don't know if I should even sh show you guys inside of here, but like I said, this used to be where I used to paint. So, and don't mind the top. I tried to clean it off, but I got to really clean, clean because sometimes some of the paint kind of got on the table. Um, so this is again more pacifiers um i have my goat hair brush stuff um i have i don't want to show that let's see does it have the name on it it probably do um and then like you know miscellaneous stuff hold on let me just make sure this don't show anything so miscellaneous stuff zip ties what i clip my zip ties with air freshener wire q-tips cotton balls paint brushes you name it <laughs> so like this is like miscellaneous but i tried to get some order in it and then um like i said this used to be my reborn paint station so i had three workstations um and this is where I use that um, um, but it, I used to take this off and then it just be like plain space and then I put the little dental pads there um, I will show my closet in a separate video but this is basically where I work you know and some days like if I'm just want to come in and just sit in the nursery I just come and sit in the rocker um like i said taraji joey um bridget and a lot of other ones are not usually in this room all the time and if they are they're usually like sitting down somewhere they used to be in that corner but i've changed it because i usually have them kind of staged around the house taraji is normally sitting in the front room like uh phoenix used to be but now um, I brought her up for you guys to be able to see. But yeah, that's usually my 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 place. I'll sit right there. And that's where I usually do my videos. So eventually, this is going to get organized. 
that's going to be cleared off. My goal is to be able to have free space to be able to do changing videos and I don't have to keep moving a baby off because sometimes if I have this many babies in here I would have a baby on the changing table as if it's a bed so that I you know didn't have to have multiples in the same spot I used to have babies on these shelves but I packed them up um and I don't like a whole bunch of babies like in one crib but Orion is going to get sold eventually. Um, this one is going to get sold eventually. And then it will only be those four. And then I'll probably space them out and change them around so that it's not that many in here. Um, but yeah, that's, that's basically it. Nothing fancy about it. I would love to have the dream nursery that I see where everything is coordinated, like have all, you know, matching furniture pieces and stuff like that. And eventually I think I'll figure out a way to do it and still have it function. Um, because it's a lot of space in here, but it's just, you know, collecting over years, adding a piece here, a piece there. It doesn't, you know, it just haven't worked out yet. Um, when I first started and I wasn't painting, it, it was more uniform but I can't I can't do that in this space and I don't want to have to share multiple rooms to you know make my videos do my work and stuff so yeah but anyway um I am going to end this video here and I will do my closet um next if you guys want to see, I think I've already added a little snippet of my closet in the chatterbox. So, um, if you're not a member and you want to join, go ahead and join now. And go and pop on over there and, and check out some of the videos that are up in there. And um, But other than that, I will do videos later. And we'll, that's it. Bye-bye.